Hi everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to Back to the Future the Game for more point and click adventure game action. We are right back where we left off in Marty's house in this weird alternate 1986 and we're gonna talk to George McFly and see what we have to do next. Um, so let's take a look at these floppy disks. Brock 2.0. Anatomical constructs for sciences of all sorts. <laughs> boring. Why is that boring? Uh, right, well there's all these monitors. There's a VCR, some switches, monitors. Uh, should we just look at the monitors? What the hell was that? Uh, how do we just look at the monitors? What are these weird, like, stick men things? It looks like, you know, when you have to go to the toilet and it has the symbol? I'm not really sure what it's all about. Um, right, let's look at this one. That's town, isn't it? Uh, what about bottom right? That's town as well. Wait, did he give us the demerits? What do these do? Oh, so it changes the camera angle. Why is he so okay with us just pressing all these buttons, by the way? Oh, that turns that one into some weird saying. Uh, not really sure what that's about. Do you have to put it onto that setting? Perhaps we do. Why is he just letting us press these without saying literally anything? Hmm. Right. Okay, there's the crossroads. Are we looking for anything in particular? It's us. So there's one on us as well. Um, can we do anything with the VCRs? Oh, it's recording. I don't want to mess up Dad's work. Okay. I'm not sure if this is some sort of puzzle. Let's talk to George. Um, I saw Mom downtown. She told me to give this to you. Thanks. Say, uh, what gives around here? Ah, uh, you know, the usual. Keeping tabs on Hill Valley through my trusty bank of monitors. Always on the lookout right. for some interesting footage. Uh, what exactly are you looking for? Interesting. What do you mean, interesting? What kind of silly question is that? I've been gathering candid documentary footage for Citizen Brown's promotional videos for over a year now. I know your right. mother doesn't approve of my work, but... Wait a minute. You say you saw Lorraine? 11 to yeah. 12 hair salon, 12 to 12 20 lunch at soup mo counter, cream of asparagus with crackers. What was that? What's wrong with that? You know your mother's problems. If she slips up problems. again, it could mean demerits for the whole family. There she is, polishing the statue in the park. Just like the schedule dictates. Oh, then everything's fine. Good. Unless... How was she when you spoke to her? Lucid? Sober? Uh... Right, so she's got a drinking pro problem, I guess. Uh, I'm not going to rat on Mum. You're being overbearing. Dad, you are way off here. Mum isn't a... Shh. I don't know for sure that your mother has relapsed into her old ways, but she's been acting very odd lately, almost as if she didn't like my constant supervision. Confidential. Well, he would. I suspect she's got a flask hidden somewhere, probably very near the spot where she's working Ooh. right now. Do can we me a get favor, that? son, will you? See if you can worm the truth out. That of might her. get us a demerit. She won't confide in me, but she may be less guarded with you. Double rations this week if you help your old man out. What do you say? That's a good boy. Okay, Dad. We didn't even get to, to answer. Uh, where? What were you hiding when I came in? Who were you hiding when Who I came you in just on? now? Hiding? I don't know what you're talking about, son. Come on, mm. I saw it. It was a videotape, right? Um, I might as well tell you. After all, you'll be 18 soon. Is it a dirty what? video? Hill Valley under Citizen Brown is not quite the contented town you were led to believe it was. Oh no, it's just some sort of... Uh, you're kidding. You're kidding. This isn't a criticism of the great man himself, of course, or his sainted wife, Edna. No one sainted wife, than really? To apply the most advanced social planning techniques to our municipality, but... What? Confidentially, not everybody appreciates it. A great many ah. citizens, perhaps even the majority, actively resent the Brown administration. The majority? They don't say so publicly, of course. But in private? Well, just listen. 
I'm listening. This regime is a joke. They're all laughing at us over in Fairfax. A toast to Citizen Brown. May his beloved courthouse be struck by lightning. Huh, <laughs> well, Your funny uncle. story about that. Are you coming to the town square, Lester? Citizen Brown's about to give another speech. Citizen Brown can kiss my hairy. Well, you get the idea. Mm. Uh, sounds like people can't stand what the Browns have done to Hill Valley. Not everyone. Only around 50%, maybe 60 those citizen brown know uh, is that enough for Whenever a majority I decision of my raw footage to the public vote? relations department over at the courthouse i get a memo telling me how much citizen brown thanks me for my service but how could he see those videos and not do anything about it maybe you hmm. should take your tapes directly to brown oh i don't know about that i mean sure he might appreciate my bringing these problems to his attention and reward me for my public service but then again they say it's never wise to be the bearer of bad news Mhm. Mm I can do it. Give them to give me. Give me those videotapes. I'll take them to Citizen Brown. Thanks for offering, son, but I don't want to get you involved. Citizen Brown won't like what he sees on them, and I wouldn't want you to get in front of his displeasure. Not to mention the displeasure of all the folks on the tapes. Once they find out I recorded them, no, I'm not letting yeah, I mean, these tapes out of my sight. It's too dangerous. Invasion of privacy. Right. Ask about mum. It's about mum. Uh, how did she get like this? How did she get to be such a mess? This isn't how she is in my, in my perfect world. You're right, <laughs> it's a real puzzle. Because of course we both know Hill Valley is a perfect world. But for some yes. peculiar reason, the it harder is, I yeah. try to get her to conform to the rules, the more she slips up. Interesting. Psychology, eh? Right, she's considering Citizen Plus program. I was thinking about signing up for the Citizen Plus program. Is she now? You're yes. not going to let her go through with it, are you? You know, that's a brainwashing yeah. thing. From what I hear, it's a fairly drastic procedure which completely reshapes the subject's personality. On the other hand, if Citizen Brown recommends it, it's gotta be a good thing. Really? Can't you back off? You think Mom would be a little more relaxed if you gave her just a little bit of space? Now, there's a fine suggestion! What would Hill Valley be like if people gave each other space? Amazing. Be tempted to Better than this one. Impulses, and there's no telling where that might lead. It wouldn't be that bad, right? Let's change the subject. Hmm. Something on your mind? Uh, yep. Let's talk about us. It's about me. I'm all ears. Well, what are we like? Uh, from certain things I've heard, I get the idea that people in this town regard Marty McFly as a as a what? A nerd. They said that. A nerd. In a so dork. many words. Just because a boy studies hard and gets straight A's and respects the rules and doesn't party or drink or stay out late and is perhaps a bit socially inept and obsessed with personal hygiene and prefers his rubber band collection Stop. to I really rubber don't band hear collection. I'm Fair enough. Proud Each to their own and all that. Uh, let's ask about Jennifer. I'm trying to understand why Jennifer broke up with me in this time, uh, in your recent past. Are you still mooning over that girl? Forget her! She's bad news! Why my surveillance cameras have caught her doing things that, that are completely against the Hill Valley code. Oh no! I don't want to know. Kissing boys. Sitting with boys in cars. Sitting with boys in cars? For, for father's sake, but believe me, <coughs> you're well Can't believe her. it. Uh, where can I find me? You, uh, is there anywhere you expect me to be, like, right now? Well, I did expect you to be up at the lake until tomorrow with that math and magic competition, so... What's math and magic? I guess your time is pretty much your own right now. Okay, different subject. Okay, different subject. Yeah? Let's ask about him. So about you and your, uh, work. Shoot. Work. Uh, how did you get to be like this? You seem to be really into this spying business. It's not spying, son. It's cinema verite. These candid moments right, of Hill yeah. Valley's residents will eventually be compiled and edited into the documentaries and promotional materials that advertise our way of life to the rest of the world. Is that what you were told? True. You can argue that I've taken things to extremes, but I still get up to take my meals and, of course, to use the facilities. Uh, you're supposed to be a sci-fi writer, you know be, that? I mean, wouldn't you rather spend your time writing, say, science fiction novels? Science fiction. I did mess around with it once, but that was before Citizen Brown made it illegal. Illegal? Science fiction's illegal? 
Sci-fi promotes what is this place, an honestly? obsession with the fantastic and impossible, and it encourages the idea that there might be better wow. societies than Hill Valley, which is subversive nonsense, of course. Of course, yeah. Okay, I can't subject. believe this place. Yeah. This gets worse and worse. Uh, it's about someone we both know. It's about someone we both know. Yes? Uh, tell me about Biff. Have you seen Biff lately? Not since he went to the reconditioning center. Is he back among the living? Depends on what you mean by living. He's really different from the way I remember him. Lucky dog. In a way, it isn't Why? fair that Hill Valley's biggest scoff law should be the first to receive the benefits of the new Citizens Plus program. But I know I shouldn't be jealous. Okay, tell me about Citizen Brown then. Have you ever spent time with Citizen Brown? Well, of course I'm in the audience for every one of his public addresses. One on one, I mean. Oh, no. He'd never notice a common Sector L citizen like me. What well, Sector but L? I dream that someday he'll recognize me for my public service and maybe let me shake his hand. Wow, shake his hand? Surely not. Tell me about Edna. What can Jeez. You tell me about Edna. Mrs. Citizen Brown? Oh, she's Mrs. A Citizen Brown. Woman. People just think of her as this sweet, self effacing, grandmotherly type. Edna? Right. Are we talking about uh, the same? Really, she's just sound as like involved her. in running the town as her husband is. Doesn't surprise me. Uh, tell me about my brother and sister. Uh, David and Linda. Have you heard from them? No, I thought maybe you had. <sighs> Not in ages. As far as I know, he's still working for the big city newspaper, and she's still in that women's boarding house. I'll never understand why they decided to leave Hill Valley. Because it's rubbish? Mm. Jeez. Get with Something the program, man. Uh, let's go ask about Hill Valley and the rules. Hill Valley has a lot of rules. It certainly does, for our own good. Alright, yeah. How could kissing be illegal? Public kissing is illegal, right? Ah, the old PDA law. Indeed it is. And what's more, violation carries a hefty load of demerits. But you know, it's a law people break with surprising regularity. But I could show you videotaped evidence. Oh, exactly. Okay, people get that's other a bit weird. To break it. On second thought, perhaps I shouldn't show you the videotaped evidence. Right, okay. Uh, contraband is bad, right? If I got caught with a contraband item, I'd get in a lot of trouble, right? You certainly would. You could be facing up to a thousand demerits, depending on thousand the Thousand demerits? Of course, you wouldn't be caught dead with anything illegal. It's your mother I'm worried about. Right, so I'm guessing she's probably got some and we can get it from her. Do we have a dog? you ever harbor a dangerous animal? Aha! Couldn't if I wanted to. They've all been banned. But I did that sounds something rubbish. very interesting on one of my monitors yesterday. Which one ah. was it? Oh, yes. Does that look like a stray dog to you? Sign Whatever sign. it is, Edna's animal <coughs> patrol will make short work of it. Okay, uh, I'm guessing... You ever... Right, yeah, so we've asked those questions. Hmm. I don't know something why they stay there when we've asked them. Uh, what's the deal with the house, then? What's the deal with the house, Dad? I don't know how to tell you this, son, but while you were away at your math and magic competition, our house got slapped with a CZ-36 violation. What? What is that? I know, it's so embarrassing. Your mother's mortified. She works so hard to keep a clean house, but those dust mites are so hard to keep down. Dust Wait mites, really? We can't go into the house because of dust mites? Well, not until they send in the cleanup crew. This is ridiculous. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Goodness, they let me move my office out here into the garage. Really? Dust so, mites? Uh, when is this dust mite problem going to be solved so I can get to all my stuff? Well, the cleanup crew said they'd probably get around to it by tonight, but they're kind of backed up, so I wouldn't expect them until tomorrow morning. Tomorrow? Brilliant. Uh, where am I supposed to sleep? I got it all covered, son. We're going to camp out back just like we did when you were little. Okay. This timeline is officially a nightmare. <laughs> What's wrong with camping? Uh, how do these monitors work how then? Exactly, does this setup work? I'm glad to see you taking an interest. Each of these monitors is connected to multiple cameras, of which I've strategically jacked into throughout the valley, with official clearance, of course. I can switch between yeah, of course, cameras with you these know, buttons. Wouldn't do it's it illegally. Also a PCR for each monitor. I keep a record of everything I see. So, if I happen across something intriguing, I can keep it on file. Right, so I don't know if we well, need anything. I'll leave you to your snooping. 
supervising, son. Supervising. From the monitors, but right. we know Einstein's around somewhere. And obviously we didn't know that before. Uh, what's this computer? I missed nice. this. We didn't have a computer in the other timeline. I... Uh, uh... Well, no joystick. That's lame. That is pretty lame. Joysticks. Do you remember those? Right, so it looks like we've done all we can here. We can't go in the house, I'm guessing. Wow. Damn those dust mites. the hell? Don't violate the perimeter, son. Oh, sorry. Effective against moths, mosquitoes, and tannins. <laughs> yeah, that's true. As we found out. Right, so, um... Can we do anything with this? What's the problem, citizen? Uh, everything's perfectly alright now. We're, uh, we're fine. We're all fine now. Thank you. How are you? Alright, so nothing... Right, I've pressed the wrong button again. I want to use this one. Right, we've got the guitar, we've got the demerits. So I'm guessing that we've got to go back into town now. Which I think we can do by clicking on the car. So we know Einstein's about. Maybe we can use this guitar to show Jennifer that we're actually cool. And then maybe we can get some sort of contraband from our mum. Which will hopefully be enough to get us a whole bunch of demerits. And that will hopefully allow us to get an appointment with Citizen Brown himself. But we shall see. Uh, so Einstein was somewhere over there, wasn't he? Kind of weird. Um, right, let's talk to Lorraine. Mom? <coughs> uh, let's ask about the flask. Mom, are you uh, drinking again? Don't be silly, dear. Booze is illegal, you know. Yeah, Mom. It's just that Dad mentioned... Your father. Why, I just can't get away from his prying eyes. Always spying. Always watching. I know. What you, a weirdo. You mind your own business, George. Now, Lorraine, yeah, George. This is for your own good. I know you're keeping a secret from me. It's mine to keep. <laughs> Dad. Mom. Knock it off, you two. Now, you listen here, young man. This is an adult matter between your mother and me. Dad, I know, but your way isn't working. You can, you gotta give her some space here. Huh? Where'd she go? Mom? Aha! Uh -huh. I knew it. What is that in your hand? Rum? Gin? A wine cooler? For your information, it's brass cleaner. I have a job to do here, you right, know. Right, so is the flask in the barrel? Lorraine, that barrel, the no. bucket. Lorraine, I'm just trying to look out for you. You know the kind of trouble we can get into. Can we even click on the bucket? Yet. George, I wouldn't be so on We can't you actually. That's weird. me all the time. Was that an admission? Uh, an admission of how smothered I am by you? Well, wow, these two are just going to have an argument. Mom. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Let's ask about us. I'm having a bad day, Mom. Can I ask you a few things? We all have our share, son. Uh, what have I been up to? I don't think that's going to help. All right, all right. Let's talk about something else. All righty, dear. So I think we have to figure this out in a bit. Um, let's go and talk to Jennifer and see if we can use this guitar to do anything. If we can, we might be able to get some demerits for that. I wonder where Einstein is. There must be some way we can get him to come to us, right? But perhaps we need... Oh, she's gone in there. Can we open this now? Locked. It's locked. I'm guessing we don't have a way to open it. Right, is the graffiti on the wall? She missed a spot. What is the deal with this plank? It looks like we can walk I over this. I don't want to go digging through the trash unless I absolutely have to. Won't let me though. Uh, we looked in all of here, didn't we? Right, the blocked doorway is still there. Can we go in through this door? That leads to the soup mo. Leech is in there. I'd rather he come out here. 
Right, is there a way we can get him to come out here? Um, can we maybe use... Wait, what's going on with the wall here? She missed a spot. Oh, okay. Can we play the guitar to the door or something? Let's see if that works. That's no way to treat such a fine guitar. No, okay. I wonder if there's a way we can get through the blocked doorway as well. Hmm, so we can't do anything there. Maybe we can... Oh, the bell's back. Okay, okay. Welcome to Soupmo, where soup is just... Oh, it's you. This better be important, McFly. Uh, it's very important. Was that Jennifer? Well, A, it's none of your business. And B, seeing as she ain't your chick no more? Yeah. Okay, now this timeline is really messing <laughs> me off. Okay, you and Jennifer, what's this with the sneezing? What's on the menu? Free samples. Okay, let's and try Jennifer. this. Really? Oh, is the poor little nerd jealous? Well, yeah, nope. and a little disgusting. Oh, apparently we are. <laughs> That's probably the soup. Uh, watch yourself. You better treat Jen with respect, Leech. Hey, I got nothing but respect for Jennifer. Respect for her eyes, for her hips, the way she wriggles when she... Hey! Now, that dork that let her get away, there's a loser that I got no respect for. Right, okay. What's with the sneezing? You got a cold or something? Ugh, oh, it's allergies. I swear, there's a dog hanging out around here somewhere. Ah! Somewhat. A dog? Yeah, and the stupid mutt keeps trying to steal my free samples. Really? Are you sure? Are you sure there's a dog around here? Listen, smart boy. There's only two things I'm allergic to. Dogs and disco, and I don't hear dogs no... Dogs and disco. Wow, do you? No. Then it's a dog. Uh, okay, what's on the menu? What's on the menu? Soup. Just soup? And more. More? What falls under the more category? We got neat loaf. It's made with textured wheat protein. Uh, no thanks. Okay. Uh, what kind of soup? What kind of soup you got? Uh, scrolle... Rivellini? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Some things never change. Okay, any more more? What else falls under the more category? Well, there's the hum burger. It's made from pressed roasted hummus. Do you have any real okay. meat back there? Define real. Anything edible? I'm afraid to ask, but what other non-soup food do you have? Anything edible? Well, we have these pea and liver with soy cheese hot dogs. They're new, and we're offering free samples. You want one? Yeah, yeah, I'll have one of those. Here are the free samples. Here, I keep them behind the counter. Right, I bet we can use these to get Einstein to come to us, right? Oh, God. If you puke, you're cleaning it up, wuss. <laughs> I, I can't finish this. Not my problem. Right, so we've still got it. Um, okay, never mind. See ya. Smell you later. So, we've now got that, so I reckon we can use that to get Einstein to speak the hey. devil. Here he hey. is. Where's that mangy? <coughs> Go get him, McFly! <coughs> okay, so we went round there. So he must have gone down the alleyway. <gasps> okay, he went over that. Okay, so now we know where he is. Right. But that is going to do it for this episode, guys, because we're out of time. So in the next one, we'll play the guitar for Jennifer, and we'll see if we can get over that plank to where Einstein's hiding. And that might be two of the demerits that we need. So it's coming together slowly but surely. So, as always, guys, thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, click on that like button. It really does help the channel to grow, so I do appreciate it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you're new or just haven't already done so. And I'll see you all next time.